And to getting to the point of the nationalism and globalization, we're getting to the elections and the fraud that we had uh, with Joe Biden. Uh, as you remember, that was too many things happening over there. Uh, and, uh, uh, you know, it's, uh, Trump and uh, even his attorneys, uh, Rudy Giuliani and all the uh, whatever that would ask, uh, it's, uh, they were even that he was blocked. It's on the Facebook and it's uh, Twitter and uh, all these uh, uh, globalized uh, media and mass media that's uh, right now the controlling uh, are the giants uh, controlling the uh, world as a global a global globalization that you are part of them. There are no Marxists, part of them. Uh, they are uh, you know far uh, socialists. Uh, part of them they are China. It's uh, CCP as the communist, uh, uh, communist, Chinese Communist uh, Party that was running behind uh, getting to power uh, of the Joe Biden, they say sleepy Joe Biden, uh, in confrontation with the, the nationalists. As the nationalists, that was to make America great again. Uh, the same thing also, it's, uh, these frauds uh, happened also in Israel, we have a coalition, a coalition of the Islamists, uh, as well that are, uh, you know, post-Zionists, anti-Zionists, uh, Arab Zionists over here. There are a Muslim Brotherhood, uh, and from the other side, there are far-left socialists, uh, as well uh, those that are uh, center. Uh, we say uh, uh, right-wing altogether. Eight. Uh, uh, eight parties got uh, all together over the years. If we think there's a confrontation over here uh, behind everything that's happening, not only in Israel, not only in Iran, not only in Pakistan, Afghanistan, uh, and the, 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 the uh, President Moody uh, also is a nationalist. As an, a nationalist, there's confrontation between two ideas, globalization, yes, uh, from one side, and the, so we have the uh, nationalists. 